Remember the rules in the matchup. Pretty much there are no rules. Anything goes, and you can pin your opponent or make them submit anywhere in the entire arena. I mean, you can do it out of the street. You can do it at the concession stands, back in the locker room. You can do it anywhere. Watch out here. Goal rattling. <laughs> what a forearm. Ooh, well measured. Oh my God, a clothesline. Oh. Big forearm smash. Evading possible disaster there. Waist lock, no, no! Belly to belly! My goodness. He's fighting hard and it's paying off. Things are really going his way now. Gargano dodged that one. Rolls through. Look at this. Snap suplex. Oh, he knew that was coming. Oh, what a forearm! Byron, is it possible to avert disaster in a matchup like this? Competing in WWE is grueling enough, but when it's extreme rules and everything is legal, you are in a different level of combat. Things break down very... Whoa, this is surprising, Byron. Yeah, I'm not really sure why he would let him out right there. Lightning fast reflexes. Boom, what a forearm. Texas Jack. Could be eating soup for a week. Ooh. Guys, Tommaso Ciampa taking full advantage. Ooh. Big knee to the midsection. Just caught flush. It's the Dragon Sleeper. Will there be an escape for Gargano here? Gargano's resiliency is being put to the test. The match is over. That's all. We're ready to go, folks. And right across the ring from him, we have Velveteen Dream, a master of mind games, the epitome of sports entertainment, the definition of an experience. And when you put it that way, Corey, Velveteen Dream becomes even more intimidating. Ooh, Jeez. he's treading all over their opponent. Big time clothesline. Good grief. He's executing on his plan perfectly. He is getting fired up here. Anticipated that attack perfectly. Big knee. And right between the shoulder blades. Close line. Well, that'll leave a mark. Showing some quickness. And this match can change that fast. Snap suplex, very effective. Ooh, what impact. In a matchup like this, Corey, what is something the competitors need to remember? Well, a major difference in a triple threat is that you can lose a match without being part of the decision. Victory can be stolen from your hands in an instant. And that's why in this match, a competitor must be cunning, calculated, and move with silent speed. Oh, what a forearm! Big time clothesline. Good grief. What's he planning to do here? Roll him on his belly, single leg crab. Apparently a change in plans here. I don't know why, he seemed to have him right where he wanted him. Reverses, can he make him pay? Oh, what a right hand! No man does that better. Boy, that one hit the target.
Uh-oh, in the clutches. Velveteen Dream. Dream. I don't know if he can hang on. I don't know if he can survive. Looks like he has other plans here. I think he was just looking to soften him up a little here. Applying pressure to the leg and back here. Fighting for survival. They tapped out. And so it begins. Despite triple threats being every man for himself, history has shown that the match's dynamics can create unlikely alliances. A participant must be ready to endure double team attacks at any time. Oh, right up there. Nice snap, Mayor. Ooh, a chop. Oh, Boom, man. a forearm smash. Double axe handle. Boom, oh, what an uppercut. Jarring. Uh oh. What a hurricanrana. In a bad way here, guys. Joe's got him up. He's in full control now. Rey Mysterio creating opportunity. Uh-oh. Jawbreaker! Call it Dennis. Face Buster plants him. Oh, stomping away. Corey, would you agree that triple threat matches can lead to unexpected alliances? Oh, absolutely. Triple threats create circumstances that lead to interesting bedfellows, allies out of necessity. Eliminating the strongest entity so you can go one-on-one -on -one is a common game plan. He had it locked up and made his opponent tap. If you ever needed a reminder that superstars in the WWE are the toughest competitors in all of sports entertainment, tables match will do it. What some fans don't realize is that the pain in these matches usually comes before the finale, when they're using the table as a weapon or a torture device. I definitely don't envy anyone in a tables match. I'm glad the only table I have to deal with is our announce table right here. Wow, oh, what a forearm! He had it scouted. Going for the cover. Plenty of fight left. I don't think his opponent was expecting that. This is some great offense by Finn Balor. Looking stunned. Looking rocked. He might have been waiting on that one. Oh, flipping the script on him there. Sequence. Oh, man. And there's the reversal from Finn Balor. And now that one's countered. Oh, what a forearm! Byron, in this type of setting, how important is it to be in control of the match? You always want to have the upper hand, but in this type of matchup, that does not necessarily guarantee a victory. We've seen competitors who've taken a massive beating when a match like this simply by moving out of the way or executing a miracle reversal. Absolutely, Corey. It doesn't matter who has the advantage, who has fired off more offense in a match like this. This is WWE. There's no point-based system. It's about getting the job done by putting your opponent through the table.
wicked oh. body shot. Big time clothesline. Good grief. Double arm lock. Oh, a nice jab from the Lone Star State. Texas jab. Be eating soup for a week. Oof. What's he got in mind? That hit the spot. He's finished. You never want to be on the receiving end of one of those. Stomping. Ouch. Turning the momentum to his favor. He's in non-stop attack mode. Lashley just barely got out of the way. Oh, what a forearm. Oh, and a terrific reversal by Finn Balor. And Finn Balor slips out of Bob's way. Extraordinary elusivity. Back in the ring now. Nice right hand. Oh my goodness. This superstar just strike it at will. Oh, like a heavy bag. are about as bad as they could possibly cover. Shoulders are down. One, two, three. I don't know if he'll fully recover from this tables match. I would be remiss if I didn't mention, and it's important to remember amidst the chaos of a triple threat match, that victory can be achieved in many different ways and that it's every man for himself. Daniel. Great evasion. Oh. Oh, what a forearm. Saw that one coming. Harsh impact. With a 180, Kofi Kingston, the reversal. Boy, oh, you're a pin uppercut. Big time clothesline. Good grief. Corey, this match gives competitors so much to consider, so much to be on the lookout for. What are some of the hazards? Well, you never know when you're going to be blindsided or which opponent will try to jack you up next. Allies become enemies at a moment's notice. A competitor needs every ounce of situational awareness they have if they're going to survive this. You got to check your chin. Oh, what a forearm! Oh! Really just laying it in. Ooh, no luck against Kingston there. Kofi just too fast. Showing a lot of fury with these attacks. Just a steady dose of punishment on display. Close line! Oh, nasty impact. Boom! What technical prowess from Kofi Kingston. No, another reversal. Neither one of them are willing to give an inch here.
Texas jab. Be eating soup for a week. Ooh. Oh, what a counter. Oh, what a right hand. Couldn't have done it better myself. X marks the spot on that one. No, it's not over yet. Wow, part of me thought he was going to tap, Cole. Daniel Bryan with a slick reversal. Drop kick to the knee. Ugh. Great reversal. I got to say, I'm impressed. And here we go. Single leg crab. Oh, this is going to be painful. Half crab is locked in deep. Normally it's Daniel Bryan making people submit, but it's. Oh my God, he's done it. He scored the win. Zid fellas, we're ready to get this thing started. Brock Lesnar still enters every match as the odds on favorite. Yeah, I would never predict the Lesnar loss, Saxton. Michael Cole takes shelter. Here comes the storm. Great agility there. Look at this. Beautiful Northern Lights suplex. The beginning of the end. Oh, what a right hand! That belongs on a highlight reel. Nobody does it better, Michael. Corey, there are so many variables in a triple threat. Does that make it possible to execute any sort of strategy? Oh, everybody's got a plan until they get drilled in the face. You gotta watch your back. The shot that hurts the most is the one you don't see coming. Byron, how do you plan for a battle like this? Well, I try and fight out of a corner because then at least you see everything that's in front of you. He's certainly looking in command at the moment. He's looking relentless. Nice amateur takedown. Here it comes! Seth Rollins got out of dangerous path there. Great move by the architect. Now trampling the opposition. There's a big reversal by Seth Rollins. How good is Seth Rollins? Elusive movement there. That is a great reversal. Oh, he's got him up high. The fall away slam. It's the dragon sleeper. This is not a familiar position for the beast incarnate. The beast may tap out. Are you kidding? Locked up and made his opponent tap out. 